student's book, page 20. 3. Daisy's Tiger Dream Daisy had a beautiful big bedroom with big windows and a big balcony. She had lots of nice clothes to wear, different computer games to play, music to listen to, and movies to watch. She had fantastic roller skates, a new guitar, and hundreds of books, comics, paints, and crayons. Oh, but I'm not happy, she thought one night when she went to bed. I know. I can ask my parents to buy me some more exciting games and a longer skateboard, a better bike, and a newer laptop. Yes, that's a great idea. Then Daisy went to sleep and had a very strange dream. In her dream, Daisy saw a lake and a big mountain. She couldn't see the top of the mountain and Daisy couldn't hear any birds or any animals. She could only hear the wind. There was a little white boat on the lake. Daisy got into it, and in the light of the moon and stars, the boat sailed quietly across the water to a cave. When the boat stopped, Daisy got out and looked into the cave. She saw some steps and went down, down, down into the mountain. She counted the steps. Forty-four, forty-five, sixty-one, sixty-two, ninety-seven, ninety-eight, ninety-nine, one hundred. When she stood on the last step, Daisy saw a small orange light in front of her. The orange light got bigger and bigger. It's a tiger, she thought. And it's coming nearer and nearer. But I'm okay. I'm brave. I'm not frightened. The tiger opened its mouth. I'm not frightened, Daisy thought again. Ask me a question, child, the tiger said quietly. Why aren't I the happiest child in the world? I have really cool clothes and lots of exciting games and brilliant CDs and movies. People aren't happy because they have things, child, the tiger said. Be a good friend, and be kind to animals, and enjoy the light from the sun, moon, and stars. Do that, and you can be happy again. Then Daisy woke up. She heard her phone. Her friends never called her before breakfast. Hi, Daisy. It's Jack here. You and I never talk at school because you're always too busy. But I can't do our music homework. You're very good at music. Can you help me with that? I've got a new guitar too. I know you're very good at playing the guitar. Can you... Can you help me learn to play the guitar, too? Daisy thought about her dream. She smiled and said, Yes, Jack. I can help you do your homework and give you guitar lessons. You're really kind, 
Jack said. Thanks a lot. Daisy went downstairs to have her breakfast. Her mum was in the kitchen. Daisy, she said, we've got something for you. But I don't want a better bike or a... Daisy started to say. Her mum pointed to a black and orange kitten and said, Dad found it outside last night. Be kind to it. It needs a good friend. Daisy thought about her dream again. She picked the kitten up and smiled at it. Hello, she said. What a pretty face. You look like a tiger that I know, but you're smaller and more beautiful. What tiger? Daisy's mum asked, but Daisy didn't answer. I'm really happy this morning, mum. I can be a good friend. I can help Jack do his homework and learn the guitar. I can be kind to this funny little kitten and look at the sun. It's a beautiful sunny day outside. Wow! What a great day!